Hi hey guys, Dan the Wolfman here. Please subscribe to my YouTube page. Please fan my videos, like my videos. Um, sporting a new underground shirt, MMA.tv, the underground, mixedmartialarts.com. Shout out to you guys on the underground and the other ground. Okay, so that's a good place to go, guys. Also sporting my new twin steel tie cup today. I'm gonna show a drill from like uh, Curitiba, straight out of shoe box. Okay, so all honored uh, Ninja and Shogun and uh, 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 Master uh, Cordero, so showing uh, a drill and a little bit modifications on the drill today. Some Muay Thai stuff. Okay, so if your opponent st steps forward on a step jab, what you're going to do is, go ahead, you're going to step forward here, you're going to put your foot on the outside here, and you're going to shoot this here like a jab or a finger jab to the eyes to cup and grab the shoulder. You're going to cup here and throw the knee to the body, okay, here, and then as the knee's coming down, back to the 90 degrees, you guys paying attention? Back to the 90 degrees, and then here to the head. Okay, so we're gonna do that again. I'm gonna step out, boom, here. And step out a little bit by his foot, and I shoot this like a jab, and find the shoulder here, to cut. Throw that knee, get right into the body, and then you back to the, so back to the 90 degrees and cup the top of the head, and throw the knee to the head. Here, throw the knee, top of the head, back to the, here, from the knee, you could also come with an elbow to the head and possibly an elbow break at the same time. Downward elbow. And if you caught this and manage to extend this kind of action into an arm bar, an arm break, it might happen there incidentally, accidentally. You know, plan on it a little bit. Here. So this could be an elbow to the downward elbow to the temple. And it might be more, it can turn into a snapping, hyperextending the arm. You just saw an elbow get hyperextended in Bellator the other week, just in a punch exchange. So that's something you can always do in a fight if the opportunity arises and the timing is right. One more time, you step up here, shoot, here, here, and then here. Alternatively, you can do this instead. You step up here, throw the knee, cup down here, and work some stuff to get this man on the ground. Okay, so that's like a, a crunch on the arm. Like a keto or systema, you would see that. Okay? Okay, here, throw the knee, crunch down. Arm, arm, take it back. Whatever, you see how I got him down because an opponent steps in and a lot of times they lean their body weight forward, their head's over their center, triangle footwork like you find in Kali or Shiva. If they put their head over their center, sometimes that kind of arm trap takedown is there. One more time. Here, throwing the knee, coming here. So this is the trap. Okay? Oh, is that end up? Here. Yeah, maybe I drag them all the way here. Get there. Get this kind of position on the back. Okay? Next in the drill. So you can go to the knee and the takedown, or the knee, back pivot, knee, elbow, it's possibly an arm break through the Alternately now for the high kick. You step out from against the jab and you throw the high kick. So the partner steps the jabs and ready to block you with the forearms for the high kick. Just step in the back. From here what I do for the kick is you step out much wider. Okay, and then the kick's gonna come up at an angle from underneath. Okay, so show me that you just show this. Great fighters, back in the great pride days. So you can alternate as a drill between the knee. Um, going with the knee to step it up to the kick. So one more time. Here. Okay, I could have dragged that cut and lose his pump up at all. Let's step up to the kick. You would have ate that. <laughs> yeah. So you can go to the knee or the high kick. I'm getting a little thing. Please subscribe. Shout out to Lighting Ground. Come down to the or MMA.tv or 40 there. Thanks, guys.